This is the real life of Japan's working poor, forced to live in their cars to save money, relying on alcohol to relieve their immense work stress. At 5.15 p.m., 28-year-old Nanako finishes work. She drives to the supermarket to buy dinner ingredients. After living in a car for three years, she knows where to find free parking spots. After a half-hour drive, she parks under a big tree and starts preparing dinner. Despite the small size of her car, Nanako has remodeled it to include separate areas, and various amenities. By the time dinner is ready, it's already dark. When she's not working overtime, Nanako cooks her meals in the car. Given the limited space, she makes a few rice balls and a mixed dish, which look quite appetizing. Before eating, Nanako drinks a beverage to unwind from a long day. Originally, Nanako rented an apartment, but with a monthly salary of just $2,000. After rent and utilities, she barely had enough left to survive. Her quality of life was very poor, so she spent all her savings on a camper van. She figured it was better to use her rent money to experience a different life. Nanako also plans to remain single and continue her van life until retirement. After dinner, Nanako heads to a net cafe to shower. Net cafes in Japan often offer 15 minutes of free shower time. They also provide various amenities, including free drinks and ice cream, making them a popular choice for van dwellers and the homeless. Once Nanako finishes her shower and returns to her car, she enjoys her evening. She spends her nights watching movies, eating snacks, and drinking. Around 11 p.m., Nanako goes to sleep. So what do you think of this lifestyle after watching this video?